Hey guys, what's up? I am back and better than ever. I am super excited for today's video because I got my nose pierced. As you can see, both sides because I'm literally insane. So let's talk about it. You know, I thought it would be kind of interesting to talk about because it's one of those really common piercings that a lot of people look to getting as one of their first piercings outside of, of course, any type of ear piercing on the outer, you know, on the lobe area. I should have did one on my belly button piercing, but I never did. Wow. You're probably wondering to yourself deep, deep down inside, why did you decide to get your nose pierced in the first place? And even why er did you decide to get both sides done? Because <clears throat> I'm a bad. Uh, I just felt like it. Honestly, I've been meaning to get my nose pierced for at least the past year now. So I'm just gonna run through the basic questions that you're probably wondering. Who, what, when, where, how, and why? Let's run through it. Who? Have you guessed yet? What? I'm like giving it away, oh my god. <laughs> when? I got it done yesterday, Sunday the 6th. I was supposed to get it done on Saturday, but it just didn't work out that way. How? Girl, boy, chair. Um, I don't, you know, I don't assume genders, okay? I'm sorry. To give you a rundown of kind of how this happened, basically I went to PA this weekend to see my dad's side of my family. Don't really see them very often, so I, I decided to take that last minute trip on Friday to go see my family and my aunt said that she wanted to get me something for Christmas so she wanted to go to the mall. I had no idea what I wanted the entire time and I was just kind of gonna eyeball it when I got to the mall. So as soon as we walk into the mall the first thing I see on my left side is a tattoo shop and of course the first thing that came to my little tiny brain I immediately had a brain spark. I immediately had the idea to give her two choices. One crazy idea and one pretty simplistic idea. And I had a feeling that she'd probably go with the simplistic idea. She asked me what I wanted her to get me for Christmas and I said, well, you have two options. You can either buy me Black Ops 4 or pay to get my nose pierced. She said, what's Black Ops 4? I said, it's a game. And she said, a game? Let's, let's see about getting your nose pierced. So right outside of Bath and Body Works was a pagoda, so we immediately went there, asked about it, then decided to go around the corner to the tattoo shop that we saw when we first walked in the mall and asked about it. And this is kind of where she got sad. It turns out I didn't have my ID with me this entire trip. I had no idea where my ID was. It was just non-existent. The tattoo place was not having it without an ID, even if my aunt my mom I am the one, the one, yes, I know. was to sign for me. We would need some type of documentation of that. Not eligible, sweetheart. I was mainly upset because at the tattoo shop, it only cost $35 to get my nose pierced. I already didn't want to go to Pagoda because I knew that they were just expensive for absolutely no reason. To make the next part a little shorter because I talk too fucking much, basically we went back to Pagoda, realized that it was $52 just to get one piercing on my nose, which is absolutely ridiculous which is the exact reason why i didn't want to go back to pagoda then we started just looking up tattoo shops in the area started calling them and then soon realized we could just do it ourselves so my aunt turns to me and she has this realization and says oh my god at the sally's they have the piercing gun thing and we can just put the nose piercing in it and do it at home immediately when she said that something just sparked in my head and said go with it one, it's cheaper. Two, I can do both if I want to. Three, I can get content out of this. So after that, we go to the Sally's. We were standing there for at least a half hour trying to figure out if ABC was the right thing that we needed for this and that. And then the lady at the counter kind of just didn't know what the she was talking about because we got home later finished about five games of spades decided to start the whole piercing process and realized that we were missing a whole entire part that we had to get that the lady didn't even say that we needed so i love that for us then we kind of just decided we're gonna take it back tomorrow next day rolls around it's sunday we go to sally's to figure out whether we need to get this new piece or if we need to just return 
everything. We ended up figuring out finally that we cannot use this at all for what I'm trying to do with my freaking nose. So we decided that we were actually going to go back to Pagoda and get it pierced. So basically we went back to Pagoda at the mall and decided 100% we're going to go through with it, get my nose pierced here. I'm only going to get one because it's like really just overly expensive for no reason. We finished the paperwork, finished paying, I sit down in the chair, and this happened. And it literally would be three to one click. I will, do you want me to give you a countdown or no? Just do it. That's how a lot of people are. So go ahead and close your eyes. Just take a deep breath. This is my hand. This is the back. Go ahead and open your eyes. That's oh it. God, was it? That's it. Did it hurt? See? Like, not really. It was like a little pinch. Yeah, it's pressure. Just take a couple deep breaths, and then as long as you feel good to stand, you're good to go. But if you need a minute, that's perfectly fine. It's a big shock. But then you're good to go. Just, I would say, clean it before you go to bed tonight, and remember to use those band aids and making sure that you're cleaning it and taking care of it. You should be fine. That's it. I'm going to get my second one now. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, it really I'm wasn't so bad. excited. <laughs> Should I do it? Lord, you getting a second one? <laughs> it's up to you. Oh my God. You got me nervous already. Okay. Can we put another dot and just see like, yeah. where it would be? Okay, I think that's lined up. Yeah. Is it right? Let me see. She put the dot there. I was like, yes, let's do it. Then she made me come out, redo the paperwork, repay, and then go back in. And then this happened again. Okay, girl, I was just wondering. I'm saying hello, my niece. She's getting two piercings done in her nose, girl. This girl is crazy. Again, yeah, the thing is that eyes, we should have done the dot, dot I think. The click, the drop, the shin, you know how it is. We should have done both of the dots yes. before, but when she got one, then she decided to get Let me see, girlfriend. Let me see. Let me look at it Because it's swollen, so. I'm kind of upset that I didn't have a second camera because my aunt was really freaking out the entire time. She was just sitting here terrified. Ooh, look, I'm telling you, I'm sweating and everything. It's over, Liz. Calm down. It's okay. Like, we're done, and she was like, to go to the bar like i need a drink because that was a lot like my heart hurt i don't even know what to do right now and i was like all right the overall experience was pretty good it actually didn't hurt it was like the slightest pinch on my first one and then the second one i think because i actually never finished my sentence but because my nose was still sensitive from the first one it hurt like a little bit more but i wouldn't even call it really hurting it was just a harder pinch really pain actually was really really low like i'd give it a one like i could go through this experience a couple more times and be good so yeah that's it that's me getting my nose pierced i think i still want to get more piercings because i'm literally crazy i would get my lip piercing again yes i did have a lip piercing if you want that short story leave a comment down below i hope you guys did enjoy this video story time kind of not really getting my nose pierced my experience it was great it was lit it was fun it was exciting it was an adrenaline adrenal adre what Adre adrenaline adrenaline it was an ad un bitch it was an adrenaline and grammarly please help my wife it was a true adrenaline rush and I, I honestly loved it i really love how the piercings turned out i can't wait till i can switch them and try different jewelries and for a little uh sneak peek my aunt did tell me that she called one of her friends that actually owns a tattoo shop but she didn't know if they pierced so she called he automatically assumed that i was getting a tattoo and said that he would have done it for free but he is not in town for the next two weeks so i might be taking a trip to pa again and get my tattoo done for free so that's exciting. That's all I have for you guys today because I am literally delirious and I keep losing my train of thought every five seconds. I am just literally everywhere right now. So I'm gonna go and I love you guys.
Eu não tenho